I think for me, growing up, it was definitely something that was instilled in me by my parents. Our, our family has always found that very important. Yeah, and for me, just seeing my parents always tithe and things like that, it just kind of came natural. Um, as you get older, you, you know, you realize how much money actually is and stuff like that, like, and how much it's worth, and you're like, oh, like, it does mean something more when you're, rather than just seeing your parents and you actually doing it for yourself. When I quit my job, when we had our first daughter, um, and I was gonna stay at home and we were used to, used to a certain amount coming in, and then you took on a second job, um, but with farming and mechanics, it's just, it's a lot, and so you were gone a lot of the evenings, and we kind of gave up all of that and just kind of trusted in God. You want to hold so tight on that money because you're like, I need this, but I said, okay, God, you know what? We're gonna quit this, spend more time with the family, and we're gonna give. The more that I build my relationship with God and everything else, I want to give more. And I think when it goes back to like my favorite verse and stuff like that in the Bible is Mark 14 and it talks about the woman who brought in the alabaster jar of perfume and she breaks it and she puts it on Jesus. And, and this jar, from what it tells in the Bible there, it talks about how it's a year wages. And I just think to myself, oh wow, like that's a year wages. Could I imagine giving a year of our wages to God? I just think that's just incredible. Right after we got married, it's always something we've done together, whether it be with finances or with our time. I know serving has also been very important to us. Yeah. Serving is definitely um, one of the top ones for us. It's always been in my life too. I started out in children's ministry and things like that when I was a kid, so, and now I'm here doing that. And then with my city care, just love it and just having passion towards and well, compassion towards people and stuff like that is just, I didn't do a lot of serving before we were married, but since that's become a very big part of our lives. The lessons we've learned from, from serving, um, the, the experiences we've had, the, the way we've been blessed, that we feel because we've been generous, I think speaks volumes. Yeah, I just think we just learn a lot more about ourselves even when we do give and give our time and things like that. And um, we align ourselves with God, everything that we go through and that we experience in our lives and what we are challenged, like our challenges that have come up in our family and things like that. God reveals things through that when we are going through those challenges and that He walks along us. And it's, it's for me, it's faith when you experience things and you're going through things, it's just like, it's like God is there. Like He's walking through those things with you. Whether that's giving or not, or because He loves us, I think we just, we trust God more. We trust God with our finances. We trust God with our time that we're giving. We trust God with just everyday life things. I mean, it's believing in something that I believe in God and I'm giving through the church to God. Not to the church in general, but like through. Right, um, so I just feel very strongly about that and just, you know, I put my trust and my faith in God and I'm going to show you with my finances or with my time or whatever it might be that looks generous.